One tier four monkey versus round 78 sounds interesting because the last half of 78 is camo ceramic. So we have to make sure that the tower can pop regular and camo ceramic. So I would think the glue, and you're gonna laugh at me, but when it puts that little glue down, I'm pretty sure it pops camo, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to hit all of these unless we like last it or something, because there's gonna be a big rush of ceramics. I don't think we can take them all. Maybe, maybe, yeah, no, 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 that's not gonna work. That's so much popping, but it's not enough popping. Isn't that kind of wild? I think sometimes the glue puddles on the ground make it worse than it needs to be. And we only have one life, so that's not gonna work. Now we do have this tower and it's pretty solid. And yeah, okay, it's really solid now too because it has that double flame. So all we have to do is this. Is this gonna win in one go? How is this less than 1% if that's the case? There's no chance, right? Okay, I see why, because we are struggling against the BFB. Does it have a lot of health? 500%, okay, so that kind of changes some things here. And oh, and I can't take out purples. Okay, 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 okay. And before we get too far in, don't forget to head over to settings and use creator support code to bloom because it helps out the channel every time you purchase something from the Ninja Kiwi store. So what if we just get weird about it? Just put a bunch of these down, that covers everything really. I don't know if it'll get that full last rush. Like that's a lot of ceramics and they're just slowly coming to kill us. That's what's pretty crazy. Like, oh, did we do it? Did we do it? We did. Okay. Oh. Okay, okay, let's see what happens. And it doesn't even touch the BFB, not even a little bit. That is pretty wild, to be honest. Okay, same idea, but different tower. So we'll just keep on using this one and then hope that it does something. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. <laughs> and it takes so long to regenerate. What a goofball. Oh, okay, this one's really good. This one's really good, but we are gonna have the problem with the purples again, but can it take out the rush? It can, okay. and. I didn't think it mattered, but you can sell. So maybe we can sell for, like, let's take out the BFB. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. It's just really the purples that are gonna mess us up, but couldn't we just like sell this guy for something else that kind of takes these things out? But really the BFB is gonna be our huge problem here. Unless you just say, forget about it and just go with this one and just have him do it everything. We don't have to worry about camos or nothing. And he's gonna do it and he should be able to take out the BFB as well, right? How much health does a 500% BFB had? I thought the problem was gonna be taking out these rushes with the tier four tower and it's the BFB that's literally causing all of the problems. A Spectre is definitely a, f oh, bombs, bombs. Forget about the Spectre, let's just bomb everybody. Cause all we have to do is this and then we're good. We can just keep doing that unless, unless, unless one of them gets through. So how do we make sure that nothing gets through? And this could easily be an easy answer. Well, maybe, maybe not, because the problem with this is gonna be the fact that the BFB still, and it's only gonna do like one damage at a time and we can only shoot once, so it's kinda of a little crazy. Maybe, 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 okay, that's good. We're actually hitting everything with the regular bomb. It's kinda of cool, actually. <laughs> okay, no, 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 we're done, we're done. So I have an idea. We were able to pop this. Let's actually utilize that selling. I didn't think it would be that important, but it looks like it's gonna to have to be. And I'm thinking what we'll do is we'll take out this first rush, and here's my plan. We'll use this guy one more time just to keep everything flowing. And then what we'll do is we'll take out all the balloons. Okay, that's long enough, I guess. And then what we'll do is we'll go like this. See, but then we would have to like, oh, that's not gonna work. This would work, but how are we gonna take out the stuff? That's the problem. So we have to do this and then what do we use? Like just something like this for now, just to clean up the purples. The purples are gonna be like what's scary. There's a lot of aspects around 78 that I don't even think about half the time. Can this guy solo it? Does he even need to use his ability? He does not. So I can BFB the ability. I just need something that'll like hold off the balloons while we first strike this guy. Like that actually did a lot. Oh my goodness, that did a lot. Oh my goodness, that did a lot, a lot. But we would have to like time it to where it only takes it down like to the end, like to the very end. I liked that a lot. This tower is so good for being so bad. Like, I don't know why I think it's so bad. I just, I've always thought it's bad, but it's kind of regaining itself right now. And we might be able to solo this whole thing to be completely honest with you, except for purples. It's always the purples, I swear. Okay, so we're gonna wait for this thing to be all the way around, like last second it, and then bloop. Okay, no, it did a lot of damage to the Moabs, but okay, new plan. Kind of thinking I should go with the middle path though, so I can just take care of everything. And now what we're gonna do he can't even take down the balloons. Bring in your buddies, you have buddies. Okay, is that gonna work? We have three buddies here. Dude, seriously, are you kidding me? Maybe? No, too overwhelming. <laughs> I liked where we were going with this one. We just gotta be faster about it. And I don't really need to use it twice. So I'll just use it once. Okay, clean everything up. And then as soon as that BFB comes, we'll get rid of it. If I can find the stupid tower, don't be dumb, dude. I'm so bad at this game. Okay, maybe like hurry up though, hurry up with it. 
Okay, take it out. And now just, just for now, just for now, I'm gonna use this one because we still have money. Okay, so I'll use the Phoenix to get everybody out of here. And now we have purples. What do I use for purples? This guy, this guy. There we go. Oh, because I got it up to Tech Terror. No, 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 no. Okay, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Take them out. Take out the purples. How do I take out the rest though? Okay, now what'll clean these up in like instant kill because I kind of screwed up that. No, oh, okay, that was so close, but I feel like I ruined it. So how do we take that out a little bit better? What other towers do we have? This one could kind of do it all, couldn't it? The giant condor? No, because I can't merge. Like, cause what does he do on his own? Does he do anything cool? Um, no, the answer is no, he does not do anything cool. New plan, take out the rush with this because it, it will, oh wow, that was really, really good. Okay, take out all that, take out all that, and then we're gonna buy our dude and then we're gonna think about it. We're gonna think about long and hard what we're gonna use to clean everything else up. And I think I'm just gonna use the robo dude. I think that'll be clean. So now I can buy the robo and this one, camo. Will he pop the thing? I mean, I don't think so, right? So what I should do, okay, let's get rid of the purples and then we'll take care of the rush. I feel like we need to start this a little sooner though and the rush is gonna catch up and you gotta do both at the same time. Okay, they're gone, they're gone. So now this one at the perfect time, let's do it, let's do it. Phoenix, you got this Phoenix. <laughs> Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, that did not work. That did not work. This is way too difficult. I keep forgetting we have a pretty ace tower here. The middle path boat can pull it in one shot, but so can first strike. But then this guy can actually do damage the middle path boat. So I think I might use that one instead. And then we can decamo. So here's what we're going to do here. We're going to do this. Can you clean them all though? Can you clean them all? No, he cannot. Yes, he can. No, he can't. If he can clean all these camo ones for us, then we can use, well, I don't know what we'd use to be honest. So we just can't take purples. Well, these guys can take purples and we seem to do camo, do camo. No, it didn't even, did it get them all? It did, but then we still can't pop this one. We're still in a predicament here. Now I can tech tear. Okay, I can tech tear. This is the ugliest way to win and it's not gonna work, but we were so close. Oh my goodness. I feel like I'm making this way messier than it needs to be. It does not need to be like that. So let's do this one again. But this time we're going to use the boat because I think it's going to be way cleaner. Okay, boat. And I'm not going to worry about camo right now. I don't think that's, I don't think that matters. I really don't. And we'll pull the boat. There we go. We can actually use this one and then decamo everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just do that. I think he'll, oh, he's just doing it himself. Like that's pretty easy actually. So now we're going to do this. We're going to decamo, decamo, decamo. There we go. Now grab my, I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing. I just lost everything in my brain. My brain just farted and said, see you later, alligator. It was done. Okay, I'm wondering if this will be enough. And like when the BFB comes out now, I can switch to the boat. Uh, is that enough though? Yeah, that should be enough to take down those ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's no big deal. No big deal, guys. It's the same same end goal, to be honest with you. I just need to get these purples out of the way. How about I get the purples out of the way, then we'll deal with everything else. Just let them go through, do their thing. Okay, now there's no more purples. And then should I shimmer? Like, was that the plan here? Is shimmering like good? Shimmer one more time. Now everybody's good and we can go like this, like this. Now everybody's good. Strong, 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 strong first crit. Oh my goodness, that did not need to be that difficult. Why am I so bad? I see this one a lot and it's always intrigued me because it looks like you only get third tiers and below and only 68 out of a thousand people could even beat it. So that means it's gonna be quite tough. And you know, I like my tough and poppable challenges on round 46, which I believe is regrows. I mean, it wouldn't matter. It's all regrow, all camo anyway with increased ceramic health to the max. Only thing different is balloon speed is slow. Everything's been maxed. No, everything's different. Everything has been completely maxed except for speed has been slow because it's slow and deadly and we only have, what is that? Six camo ceramic fortifies. That's a very awful combo. Can I get multiple towers or no? Like, can I shimmer them? Okay, I can. So I can shimmer all of them. Okay, all of them. Okay, now we're good. And then what we can do is break them down very slowly, like for forever like forever, just break them down like till the end of time. And then like maybe one shot them with the sniper. Oh wow, this is gonna be a, a think a doodle for sure. We're gonna have to think our way through this one, which is usually pretty tough for me, but I think we can make it work. One reason I hate doing challenges on this map though, is hard for everyone to see. So what I think I'm gonna do here though, is like, I'll get rid of my, I'll get rid of my towers so you can't see those, but we can see this a little bit better. I like that. Now we can all kind of be on the same page without having to like stare our eyes down, but I don't think this is gonna work. Like there's a reason his name's Icicles. We'd be here all day. Unless we can f slow it down with glue. Let's do that. Let's slow it down with glue. And then we can just try to like, oh, we only have third tiers though. That's really bad. I mean, dragon breath, but the regrow rates at 1500%. Yes, it is. So we're going to have to one shot them somehow. I just realized that I probably got into something I can't even 
chew. Bite off what I chew or something like that. This is awful. So let's just try it though. Let's shimmer everybody. So shimmer, 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 and then glue, 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 but out of the, but see, once you do this though, now they're like not gonna be slow. We can do this one. Like now they're not slow, like whoop de do, you know? So what do you do with this? Now they're slow, so you're so cool. I guess you could just do it like that, but the regrow rate's gonna come right back. So we have to instant kill them. Oh my goodness, hang on. Don't we just like one shot these things? Hang on, weren't they lead? Oh no, they're ceramic the whole time. The fortified made me think that they were lead. What a doofus. Okay, so how about, oh duh, druid of the jungle. What an idiot. Okay, so we, all we have to do is slow them down. Okay, so we'll, we'll get rid of their camo. Why do I overthink things? Just get rid of their camo. Two, three, four, okay? Now we're gonna ice them because we need to slow them down. And we'll go like this. Let's just do that. I don't know if that costs too much, but I don't care. I just need to slow them down a little bit. And we'll do it one more time. Grab a druid and then go like this. I'm wondering if I should like refreeze them though. Oh, I don't have to. I could just keep buying the druid. So we'll get a druid. So one more time and then go like this. And then one more time and go like this. That's all you got to do. Okay. This one has been passed across my desk a few times. 111. But what makes it cool is that everything is a one in some way. So this person really likes the number 11 and I like it. Not only that, you only get one of each tower. Let's do it. And I'm assuming you only get like 11 tiers. Yeah, 11 tiers, that makes sense. It's on impoppable around 111. I have no idea what this round even has a hold of it, but I do know that it hasn't been modified at all. We just have a lot less money than you would normally have on an impoppable or a chimps game. And everything's gonna cost more since it's on impoppable. And my first inclination would be to like remove this stuff, but you can't sell. Well, you can remove it, but what good does that do? We do get more towers. I mean, this is not terrible. It doesn't even remove the fortified. I thought it was a fifth tier. What are you doing here? So I'm thinking, forget about it. Just do this, just do it. We seem to make him faster, right? So just do that and then we'll, what else can make him faster? Just do your job, just do it. I wish I had an overclock cause that would make him faster, but I kind of like this. Just take your time, whatever, it'll work guys. And what else could we do? We could slow him down with main Moab, but I don't want them to be broken down as a problem. What else can we slow him down with? Oh, uh, super glue, duh, we can just do that. This is gonna be super fun and easy. So if we just put the glue gunner here, maybe? Like right there, so we can make sure to get everybody. Oh, tears, our tears. Okay, we don't need all of the tears for that one because that's just garbage. So we just go with this one right here and then we get this one here like that. Ooh, okay. Now he's not the fastest thing in the world and they're not gonna pop, so there's not gonna be like relentless glue. We're just like barely slowing them down kind of garbage to be completely honest with you but maybe what else slows things down a little better if i just keep using the ninja like his middle path that could be cool i might even have the top path but not enough tears though huh this is the right idea i think is to use the bloom smash documents he's one of my favorite towers he just looks so cool you can tell he's just a very very happy guy and he knocks everything out of the park that's all we need we can't use a boat to pull anything dude this is actually working really well like really good is to guess what's going to happen here we're going to lose to a red balloon Maybe, maybe not, maybe not. If he can do it now, come on. One, re one red balloon, are you kidding me? So if that's the case, this should work. Like I don't need to do anything else but that. I almost went into this entire like progression of doing a bunch of things I didn't need to do and I could just do this. Cause now everything's piled up here as little flower power acid and it should all go away pretty simply. BMA is such a good tower. I kind of want to like focus a whole chimp strategy. It, it's kind of a bummer cause you know, you don't get all that money I don't think on chimps. But imagine if you just had him in the very back of a map and you just stalled everything. So I'm talking Icicle and Pale, you know, Moab glues, just everything to freeze these guys. It could be, dude, yes, that's what I'm talking about. And if you haven't yet, check out this video where we find a secret way to pop camo that I guarantee you've not used before.